Hi everyone and uh, welcome to the second video introducing the roguelike called The Ground Gives Away. So um, hopefully I will cover, so cover some more mechanics. I didn't have the time to show you in the first video because I died too early. So let's play and let's uh, discover this dungeon. So we start with finding an animated hand which is like the Adam's family hands which try to strangle you. They quite fast as you can see he will close to me but they're fairly easy to knock out with my bare feet alone because every time you start a new game you have no equipment whatsoever only have your fist try to punch the creatures I also remind you that in this uh, game you have no race no clay no class uh, and you earn also no experience point when you kill the creatures is useless we have an animated hand here um, because it's not blinking with a big big Z. I can't sleep. In fact, never sleeps. So I assume it may be noise seven. No, it didn't notice me. Oh yes, it does. <laughs> oh come, oh come. My noise is only seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, maybe it's because it don't sleep. I don't know. And it can open the door, so. I just have to wait for it. Oh yes, or maybe the noise works when it's in my fog of war, my nose applied. Since he can see me, as yes, that's it, since he can see me, he's now forgetting me. Okay, let's assume it works this way. Hopefully the developer of the game will tell me more about it. So this is where I should go, stairs down to go to levels. But I uh, want to explore the level first. Levels. Oh, dogs, they're really strong in the first levels. Oh, he fleeing already. Perfect. I want to fight you. Wooden chest. Buckler. If I equip the buckler, it gives me a block of two. Yeah, so let's take it. Block. How does block work? Uh, for each point of block, um, it makes it... 10% harder uh, for enemies to hit you on melee physical attack. So you see here the dog, um, the dog bites you. So the dogs had 60% chance to hit me. Now I have a block of two on melee. It will only ha have uh, 40%. This is cool. But at this point of the game, I don't want to fight. Let's close the door. Nothing to see here. Okay, flee, flee for your life. Another stairs down. Okay. Oh no, I don't want to. I don't want to fight you, man. But I want to explore this zone. Okay, never mind. I don't want to engage into you combat. I have many stairs down. Let's wait. Black glow. Shadow. Oh, if there's on, you can't fail to place it in gold. This is the very first time I see this kind of gloves. Rare. My melee drop drastically. Don't want to wear that right now. Absolutely don't want to wear that right now, but the steel gold is intriguing because. If I fight a creature like a rat, a bat, a, or a worm, a animated end, I don't assume they have gold in <laughs> them. Maybe they do. Would be a bit weird. So yeah, I, I don't equip them right now. So another dog. Come on, come on. So I have. I have to fight him. Hey, he's fleeing. Bone rat. Kind of an undead rat. You can't... Uh, <laughs> you can't uh, throw arrows at it. Because it's only bones. Yeah, it's dated. 
Dark Red Potion, Silver Coin, Nuttle, to heal a Rusty Hand Axe. Uh, will bring my melee down, but I could be able to kill the creature. MP down. Uh, only the melee I don't like. I prefer to be able to incapacitate, and it's only open melee. So if I'm on a corridor like this one, look, I will show you. So I equip the rusty hand axe. Uh, look at my melee, it's two, because I'm in a um, wide space. And as soon as I come closer to a wall, here or to a door, my melee goes down. Down in a corner, down in the corridor. So it's not really good to wear those right now. And the fact that it is rusty, because um, I need to find a grindstone to make it more efficient. Very small doors. Thinking. Thinking. Playing dog. Okay, so I have to. I have to pass here, but I only have 5 HP. Let's try something. I want to kill it. So I will. Oh, useless. Okay, I have to rest. So, it's the perfect moment for me to show you how to rest. Uh, so, the food clock mechanic of this game is really interesting, as you like. Uh, in many different games, maybe you know uh, Brog or, or Rogue of uh, other games. The more you uh, move to the dungeon, the more you lose some nutrition or some food. And this is a mechanic that um, forces you to go deeper and deeper and not to linger too long into the dungeon, into any, any level. So it adds a stressful factor, which is interesting. Um, but in the ground gives way, the food mechanics is really particular. It's a rest mechanic. So I can't rest where there are monsters inside. So I will prepare my sleep. Up. I close the doors, then I rest. And look, it will consume my food here. So yeah, I rest. Rest and recover food left. So it's another day. I only have three food right now. And when I'm at zero, I won't be able to rest. And resting is interesting, is good, because it uh, fills up all of your hit points, all of your mana points, and it brings or it resets all of your status. So it's if you've been diseased or poisoned or confused or whatever, just rest and everything is reset. But, as you will see, monsters as well have uh, recovered everything. Their statues, their hit points, their mana points if any. So yes, here's the dog. And since I can have open melee hero, Hmm. Okay, let's fight it. Uh, my bear fist. No, I don't want it to. I don't want it to fight. Okay. Being, I have. To, it's the only way I. I have to. Go, so okay, I knock it out. Oh yes, there is this hand. Come on. Really want to hit me. Okay, have other stairs down here. Vercon, good money. In case, of, in case we find some merchants, dungeon, wooden club, that will be interesting. Bring my mana points uh, to two. It's non lethal damage, but my melee is up. Resistance to fire, I mean, 10 because it's kind of wood. But what, what is interesting is that is there is a knockback, so it will, when I fight a creature, it will be uh, throwing out, it will be knocked back one time, which will be good when I find some projectiles to, or ranged attack. So yeah, that's it. Okay, I, I just punched the rat, the knockback, 
did work. That's really cool when you use the knockback against a wall because it will be smashed. Hey, what are you doing? Can't come on. Wasn't able to. So we have some leather boots. Um, leather boots. Far more ten percent. Cool. It does. It's a slimy potion. White worm. I don't. Oh, but this is risky for me. To, um, they are very weak. So let's fight it. Because maybe uh, I could find some creatures inside the wooden crate, and that will be uh, will be unwise to be taken into uh, to a fight. A weak creature, a whip. Oh, you kinky guy. Melee plus one resistance fire is reset to zero. Gain reach three squares non-lethal damage like this one. Is non-lethal damage, so this is superior in any sense. Yeah, that's really cool. Because if a monster comes close to me, I can I can whip them at three of the distance. That's really cool. And if a monster manages to come close to me anyway, I can knock it back by switching to uh, with the um, switching with the wooden club. Oh, I have a good synergy right here. Energy. I don't know if it's which word. French. It means that things goes well together. Yellow fungus. Ah. Oh, but look at that. I can use my whip. <laughs> Let's do this. Up uh, again. Okay, the yellow fungus is unconscious. He already was. Maybe this is something the. I would suggest for the developer to do is that vegetables are already mindless, mindless creatures, can't be unconscious, I don't know. Okay, let's go down. Uh, Mr. Zane, only we have the pickaxe. Okay, let's whip the ass. Okay, you can see it managed to go clump close to me, so I use a wooden club I I, I I Wow look at that he has it has been propelled um, far far away Yay <laughs> fun mechanics my mana point go be careful is it alright for you okay since you can't flee because there are some Pile of rocks and trash piles, I will switch to my whip and whip you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Are you done yet? Okay. <laughs> You've been naughty. Yeah, everybody has been <laughs> No Okay, let's equip uh and try to fight this lizard that just appears from the rocks. Oh yeah, that is knocking back. Now it's far away from one tile. I switch my whip. Whip it. Oh, it works. Perfect. Again. The whip doesn't reach that far, yes? Oh, uh, it does. Okay, so I have four, four hit points. If I continue to search to the rocks, I have I can be unlucky and find some of the monsters again. But at the same time, if I rest and I only have some uh, non-lethal damage weapons, they will recover and they will on me again so yeah we'll eat some apple and continue to 
So she's here. Oh, magic ring. Ooh, if only I had some magic. Drop on the floor. Green worm. Okay. Don't panic. They are very slow. I can whip them. Okay, there is a rat tail here. I wouldn't be able to uh, to guess, but hopefully everything is displayed here. It's really, really good. Best part. One of the best things of this game. So I'm here, over this bar, and I take it. Hit it right now, so I can up my acid resistance up to 5%. Excellent. Did a good job here. Then we close the door. So they won't be able to go out. So at this point, I think I will rest. Um, and lose one food. Let's recover five hit points. Yeah, let's try. Way. Okay, there are some lower here. Healing fountain. I drink it right now. Yeah, let's do that. Better safe than sorry. What's that? Ah, yes, we had some wand here. So I have ability to do magic because I upped my magic thanks to a thanks to a ring. But there is a dog guarding the one here, sleeping. This is seven. Four, like four. <sighs> Figure it out. Sick. Level one. Could have been able to go here as well. Yeah. This thing here. We're, we'll try it. So, we have this place to explore and this. What's good is that I have the pillar here, so my strategy will be to um, whip the dog at a distance, faster than me, but whatever. I will run as fast as I can to a pillar, then I will knock in my wooden club and switch club and whip. But I will do that after having explored this place here. Okay, there is nothing, so let's do what I just talked about. Absolutely uh, nothing else. I don't want to use right now. Okay, so the guard dog, guard dog wakes up. Run to the pillar. Even manage to like, be close to this one. Interesting. Never mind if he hits me because the knockback will be. Oh no, it's a script. Let's go here. So my block is 5, so now he has a um, malus 50% to touch me. Wooden club, knock it back. Since he's too fast, uh, I can only use my, my uh, club and uh, I can switch. Okay, he's fleeing. No, I can switch to the whip and try to whip it. Oh, never mind, I flee for your life. The twisted hand, twisted, twisted, twisted wand. Let's try what it does and press one. It caused nothing, it was a wand of chaos. Oh, okay, wand of chaos is random effect. So it can be heal, it can be, it can be many things. 
can be confusion, can be poison, so it's completely random. So, since the situation is situation here is pretty good, he's playing, he doesn't want to fight me, I don't want to use the one snowball. Who would use the snowballs? Kill the dog. I cooled. Cool? Not yet. I want to make this dog be imprisoned here. Oh? So, yes, it is. Perfect. So, he didn't even had to lose some snowballs and he will never bother me again for the rest of the island. Go down. Doors, pillars everywhere. Cool. Corridor first before the doors. Bone rat. Oh. Come on. Ooh, it's fast. Hey, it's really fast. It was slime. Don't like those. Hey. Okay. So the slime. Um, I don't like the slimes. The weapon rack here. Oh yes, I can whip it. Zero. I miss. Miss. Hey. Good. Wow. <laughs> this is heaven on earth. I've never seen such many things before. It's a bit um, too good to be true. There will be certainly some traps there maybe. Is there a way for me to up my trap detection? Not really. It is cool. I don't know what it does. Let's grab the things. What do we have? Broadhead arrows, which will require to have a, a bow to be used. Rusty ring made. Everything is rusty. Um, bring down my mana point. And oh, it makes me makes me too noisy. I prefer to be stealthy when I play, because I have a whip as well, so it's better to to move uh, swiftly and stealthy. Dungeon. Round Shion. Is it better than my buckler? It is. It is. Except for fire, so. Left. Be careful. Careful with creatures that can put fire or whatever. Ether armor. Excellent. Whip it. So, what's in the weapon rack? There was an iron stuff. Iron stuff brings on my melee. Iron stuff isn't really good. Damage, so I can kill creatures, but now I can kill them with snowball. So I want to quit. Rusty pickaxe. Ah, uh, yeah. And rusty battle axe of. Okay. Uh, do you remember? I think we we had some grindstone. No. We didn't find any grindstone yet. Other run. Listen with me. Okay. So we have some, as you can see, we have some. Uh, want to blink? Yeah. We have some mysterious veins to mine with the rusty pickaxe. But rusty pickaxe are uh, rusty, so they're fragile and then can break easily. So I will wait find a grindstone before using it. Oh, there's so much things! Crazy! <laughs> Incredible! Never been... Never been this rich, I think. I have some scroll. I want to read the scroll. 
I need to rest as well soon, so... Oh no, let's, let's continue our exploration. A road of thunder. Look at that. Electricity too. All visible monsters are engulfed in a violent thunderstorm. So for creatures that are vulnerable to electricity, we don't have immunity. Electricity, that's really cool. It can really save your life. What it is. Okay. Come on, a floating eye. Yeah, so let's take my wooden club and beat the shit out of it. Now I'm confused. I can't use nor my scroll, nor my wand, nor my rod of thunder, which is a bit very, uh, dangerous for me. No more dangerous than when before I discovered the the road. We have pillars here. I can feel confident to pursue my exploration. Hey, there's a lot of things to mine here. Vibrating on a dog. It was like, oh no, please, the slime, don't walk over the vibrating one. Look why. Um, destroy items. So please don't walk on it. <gasps> Fuck you. Sewer slime corrodes the vibrating one. Okay. Okay, I hate you, uh, but I don't want you to destroy the sling as well because the sling will be will make my snowballs to be more efficient to be used. So I'll go up. Hopefully you will come here. Yes. Healing fountains. This is not an items, but I don't want you to destroy it too. Just wait for you here and a whip. You. The fungus which make would make me diseased. Well I'm confused, diseased. Mm. I'm afraid of the dog. I think ah. um. Yes, okay, so let's equip the sling which has upped my my missile. Now I can throw snowballs. Make me confident enough to engage the dog. Maybe drink first here. No, I want to rest. Yeah, so let's throw let's throw Let's throw a snowball to the dog so it wake up, and let's run to the pillars. I'm really, I'm really uh, far from the dog, but it, it will wake up. I will miss. It will wake up. Okay. So, come on, come on. Waiting for you. Ah, this is weird. Lose me. Okay. Ah, what's up? Confusion trap. Oh no, we are. The dog is on the pillar as well, and I don't want that. So, okay. <sighs> Let's try to knock it back with the wooden club. Really fast. Confused, perfect. Um, yeah, frozen to death. Oh yes, I just mistake space bar and the zero. So I use the snowball. I lose the one ammo. It's bad. But well, dog destroy. Black ant. Resist cold, so there is no point to use uh, snowballs. And it's 25 percent resist poison and has a very hard shell and is fast. Oh no! What can I do? What can I? Do? 
I know this kind of creatures can really fuck you up, so I won't take any any risk. <laughs> I wanted to close the door. Oh no, I'm really fast. Really fast. A three eight point. That's not my arm. Yeah, it's fleeing. Yeah, I can. Kill it. Right now. Hey, no. <laughs> Are you or you're here? Won't bother me anytime. Okay, perfect. Now I have to rest. Never have. Never, never work for the dungeon when you have less than five. But I don't want the jelly to. Yeah. Okay, so let's rest. Perfect. So my hit points are replenished, my mana point as well. I'm not confused anymore, and uh, yeah, that's good. So um, the creator of the game told me that uh, the best moment to identify the scroll is uh, just after having rest. Okay, I have to unequip those. Have this one, because this one is too noisy. I want to to walk, walk uh, on stealthy. So yeah, the best uh, moment to test in identify scroll is when you wake up. So. Why? Roll of exit. Okay, so it makes me um, detect doors and uh, and exits in the dungeon. What is the other one? Scroll of resistance. Oh yes, that's really cool. Okay, so let's continue our exploration. We're only on level three. We can grind a little the dungeon. Wow. Nothing. Yes, there is some things to mine here. So I will not on my not pad. On level 3 there are mysterious veins and there are a healing fountain as well. Healing fountain and a valve. Yes, the valve here. It's there. Uh, I don't touch uh, those before having a little idea of what it could do and usually it requires to go uh, some level deeper uh, to find some place which are completely over by deep water, then you know that uh, going up again and closing the valves would maybe make the make the remove the water maybe. So, oh, time corrodes the fire trap. Okay, they've been able to like it. Oh, let's go deeper. Remember, there is a slime as well here. Pardon me. Oh, a bone rat. This one again. So don't play too fast. <sighs> okay. Let's run. A run shield. A whip. Not my whipping club. My whip. Because I'm um, use zero and not space bar, I can't use. Oh, okay, no, I can. Uh, I'm. Uh, I'm not a veteran uh, roguelike player. Sometimes I still play too too much precipitation. I'm good at all. Green worm. Come on, tell me. Will we find this place really comfortable? Yes. So yes, I have to remind myself to take my time and to check my inventory. But 
are in a hurry. Oh yeah, we have uh, detect door stairs thanks to the scroll. And uh, we can uh, some particulars here, some doors, the exit is there. We're still at level 4, I can explore it I think. At point. Things are not bad for the moment. Oh, river crab! River crab, they are really strong, they are slow, they resist cold, but never mind, I will use my whip on them. Since they are really slow, I can move around and up with them till they surrender to oh my, my dominance. <laughs> Yeah, cool. Black and N close to me, so that would be better. Huh. I have to uh, I have to remember to to switch with the rusty ring mail, which uh, gives me much better armor. I have to, rem to remind myself. Yes. Okay. What hurt? Oh. Okay, it's fleeing. Oh, I can remove my rusty ring mail. Which is around. Let me gold. I've never been this rich. Is one merchant or something like that? Or more? Thirty-five percent thanks to a leather cap. Cool. Okay. And see through the arrow slit. I have no one there. Maybe. But well, nothing. <laughs> nothing at all. Hey. Grab. Leather boots, I have those already. I need those. I want new things, a bat. Which has indeed detected me. Yep, but not if I go to the fog of war. This is this is weird. This is weird. Weird mechanics. One rat. Based wooden club. Not mine. Okay, that's well. Oh, I can, I can wear two wooden club. No way. The point of wearing two. Does it at my melee? Oh, it my block down. Hey, I didn't knew that. Girl wield. Oh yeah, I can have two wooden club, but I don't see the use. Fight it with a ground shield with me proper good block. Yeah, okay, nothing here. Keeps up fine. Move. Just. Pickaxe, a blood, blood leak. Scary energy sucking worm, which give you hunger and damage. I don't like that because I have nothing to eat, so I won't be able to rest. A very dangerous creature for me right now. Very dangerous. I have no idea. This is a worm, so I assume this is low. So I could have used I could use my rod of thunder, be quite certain that he brought it. But want to early as well. So let's assume as every other worm, it's really slow. Would be able to present it. 
Oh yes, it's really slow. Then whip it. I whip. In no tea. Okay. Yeah, I have no choice but to engage the bat. Uh, how will I do that? But let's know more about it. I have a chance. I could go there already. Don't. I don't know, maybe there are nothing to find here. Maybe? There is. There is some. Oh. You want damage? Hi. It is me? Ah, oh, yes, it does, but it's closed. Oh, cool. Oh, and I can whip it. <laughs> That's cool. I can whip it um, through the particles, through the the bars. <laughs> That's fun. Uh, you've been naughty. Okay, I was afraid for nothing. There was nothing. Up. Yeah. Yeah, so go down, keep her into the pen. Okay, level 5. This is usually where I die, uh, level 5 or. Ice wall. Last time I've been into an ice wall room, ice room I find. Some ice creatures and some ice block, some more snowballs, which can be fun. But corridors first, always. Frost beetle. Um, hopefully they don't, it can't open doors. Oh, and they just can't. Um, oh, generate fire. Melee attack. I can whip those. I can whip it. Was it? Yeah. Oh, I just threw it. Very tenacious with my whip. Copper oh. coin. A dead, dead adventurer. I remember the last time I walked, I find into a dead adventure bodies. <sighs> I've been diseased, another one has been raised as a zombie. Um, since I have nothing right now to cure me from any disease, the zombie won't be a problem because they are slow, but they can open doors. Problem. I have nothing to cure me from disease, so I won't take the risk to search here, but I will not level 5 dead adventure because who knows, they may have some weapon. Okay, let's find out. So, frost beetle, of course. Let's knock out. Well, Oh, they're really fast. Yeah, okay, we'll try one more time. If if it bring me under five hit points, I will use my rod of thunder. Hey, it's free. Perfect. Ah, merde. I have to use zero. So yeah, this is 
is like the last game, so uh, ice room with a lot of ice blocks. I assume there may be some other monsters as well. Ice monsters. Yes, Frostbeater. I'm fairly low on HP, so I want to engage it. Okay. Oh, Frost Toad. What? What? Where, where do you come from, guy? So, a giant toad surrounded by an icy cloud. Beware, it has a long frosty tongue. Uh, you know what? I think I'll use my road of thunder because. Um, can attack me right now, we can do 2 damage. So, no, I will try 1. One attack with my whip and see what happens. And if it don't, I will use electricity rod. Uh, you are not hurt thanks to my armor. Hey, didn't didn't I switch? Come on, I have to remember myself to switch. No. Yes, of course, because it will will up my resistance to call as well. So yes, just forgot to switch. Yeah, let's try again with my whip. Yeah, look at that. We are not hurt. Oh no, we just missed each other. Yes, you ignore the call thanks to the high resistance to call and you are not hurt thanks to the armor. Whew. Yes, he's being conscious now. Don't you want to be conscious as well? Okay, close the door. Um, oh, it has been waking up as well. Okay, you know. No, I will. Was it to me? I can't whip it yet. Can't whip it. Okay, no. I Okay, let's use my Road of Thunder because I will rest any anyway. So the Road of Thunder hopefully will kill both Frost Beetle and I won't have to struggle with them after I will have rest. Perfect. I have to rest. Okay, food left. I start to fairly low on food. I don't like that. And let's uh, avoid the ice block. Fine. As I said, more snowballs. Snowballs. Maybe we may wake up some monsters. Snowballs are so cool. Transparent scroll. Hey! Cold fungus. Never mind. Not even mad at you. So let's try this cool. You know more about the dungeon. Oh yeah! I have to go here. Oh, there is... Oh no, okay, so that's full. This is a full map. So it show me there is um, item here. Nothing here, so I won't bother to look here because maybe there are some monsters and Nothing is to get. Maybe. Right here. Hey. I have this uh, ice block. Ice crystal. If I eat the ice crystal. I resist. I get. I have one damage. One hit point left. But my resistance to cold is up to five percent forever. I can wait before using it. We'll wait. So yeah, let's find what's dark room. Darkness map. Plate mail. Okay, it brings my mana point to zero. I don't have any magic items. Beside the wand of chaos, I don't want to use. My armor is up to five percent. Wow. Uh, resistance to fire. Good. Only electricity. Oh, everything is good. Much better than the rusty ring mail, which makes my noise too loud. Well, I can. It doesn't. It doesn't change my 
uh, my noise so I can wear it right away. I don't have to bother by switching from normal to another. Okay. Really cool. Uh, oh! Oh, I play too fast. Play too fast. Be quiet. This is the first toad. Which has a walk up. Good armor, but cross uh, resistance with crap. And thunder, I don't want to use. Only one monster. I tried to close the door. Rest again. Come on, seriously. Now I have to beat it. Good to kill. Oh, good. Energy eye. But so, this dot already. Uh, range two. Instant hunger. But hopefully I have a whip, which is range three, so I can whip it at a distance. Yes, I've been lucky finding this one. Another valve. Not it on my notepad. Valve on five. Ah yes. Okay, I will do like with the other one. They are really slow, so we can move and whip those. Uh, I move, I whip. I move, I said. <laughs> and I whip. Move, I whip. Okay, come on. Move. Oh. Hitting me? Move, I whip, Whew. Okay, something to mine here. Okay, another frost toad. So I can't rest here, but I can run. One, two. It will certainly, oh, no, no, no. No, 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 no. Look at my dilemma, is that if I want to run and to take the stairs down, who knows if another monster don't wait for me uh, below. Uh, and during the time I will run to go to the stairs, since he can, he will wake up, look at that. Yes, he will wake up, because the disease is red, and he can hit me at two of a distance, then he will hit me, and I will be too weak to anything that could be below so I need to think about it hmm. I need to think about it um, I have potions I have no ideas there is no point in maybe yeah they only do cold damage so this is useless against cold creature which is completely immune hold so what are my options right now absolutely have no idea or maybe go down rest have uh, food this is really dangerous in fact much more dangerous than it seems so I will make the most of the fact that uh, most of the monsters here uh, are incapacitated to so look at this place because I will die here yes let's do this and maybe maybe look into the dead adventurer anyway and rest if needed Heavy potion. Is a sign maybe? I should quaff the potion and try things? Maybe? Up some. 
Cross Beetle, nope. <laughs> I don't want to fight you. But yeah, maybe I should try to drink stuff. Cross toward the hitter. So yeah, let's go out here. And let's try yeah, let's try the potions anyway. Maybe one of I need to, to make some room here and I need to find a solution. Lesser healing potion. Oh, that's cool. I can continue with that, I think. I play too fast. Now I can run, as I said. Yes! Hi! <laughs> Ooh, that's cool. I like when things happen <laughs> as you <laughs> intended to, except for another frost beetle. So yeah, uh, let's um, club it, knock it, hopefully. Fast. Okay. Whip it. <laughs> yes, okay. Another one? Seriously? Oh no! Oh no, 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 I forgot. This is a. No, no, it's a blue potion. Okay. Let's grab it. Another blue potion? Uh, fuck! Fuck, 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 fuck. I played too fast, as usual. This is a fucking snake which gives you five poison. This is. This is too, 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 too dangerous. And they're really fast as well. So. So <sighs> so I have a fairly good armor. I have a really good armor. It can be blocked. I have three block. Good armor. I can try to, to knock out and to throw a snowball at this. Let's try that. Up. I'm Poisoned, five, which means, if I'm not mistaken, that each turn I will lose five, I don't think. No, it's <sighs> okay, let's use the Rod of Thunder. Okay, it's Flea. Um, let's throw Snowball at it. Okay, it's dead. So, oh, I have to do something right now. 25 <gasps> Okay, I will quaff some potions and if nothing's good, uh, I will rest and this is my last my very last food Potion of health. Thank you very much, but I'm still poisoned, you know, so I need to find uh, a cure Vulnerability, I don't need that Triple, <laughs> don't need that either Healing potion. Thank you, but I still poisoned a lot of milk, you're less angry, but I'm still poisoned. So, okay, let's eat the ice crystal. Let's sleep because at 25, way too. Okay, I have uh, one bottle of milk, which is good to give me more food. Oh, you again? Forgot about. Let me whip you as I use the gun club. Come on. Animated hand at level six. Okay, this is like an out of surface uh, monster because this is uh, they are they are weak. I can't take any risk. It oh there. Battle X fucking bad. It's too bad. It's rusty and noisy.
rat. This is a bone rat. Okay, we have some weak, weak creature here. Oh, I don't know why. Maybe this is a room with some barrels and crates. That would be cool for me. Some new things. Wooden club. Oh yes, really good armor. The blood leech. Oh no, they are, they aren't. Uh, not. They are not weak. Close the door. Die. I close. Oh my, I hope they lose my path. They are short minded. Things more tense now. L6. Serious. Light bow. Oh, yes. Because I have some broadhead arrow. Oh, the bow doesn't do anything to change my missile abilities. But the Broadhead Arrow, they have physical damage of 2, which is really good to finish with this kind of creature. Face bar. Um, face bar. Perfect. My way here. I don't want it to touch me, because it will make me hungry. Eh, okay, I will. I'm stupid, I'm losing all my ammo for nothing. I have a whip. I made it. Stupid stuff. Better to make it unconscious first with the whip, then to kill it, because I have 100% chance to kill it when it's unconscious. Don't move. Only... Okay, now I can kill it with... I lose a lot of ammo, I don't like that, but hopefully it will uh, do me a good listen. Oh no, there are two of those. Two of them. Could use the... no, they're fairly... Weak, but better fight. Done yet? Oh no, come on. No way. Everything for nothing? No HP? What should I do right now? I still have my Rod of Thunder, still have my bow and no bows, my wooden club, I'm, I can continue my way. I don't know why, but <laughs> I think we are close to the end. Arrow slit, dark. Everywhere. Uh, this door. Oh yeah, teleporter. A dark one. Oh yes, but I can't do magic because of my late mail. Way much too anti-magic. Like it like that. But yeah, at level six I could go down. Right in the dungeon. The developer of the game told me that it's uh, when we come to level eight or nine, it becomes better to go down without clearing the dungeon. Still below this. Still fairly close to the surface. In fact, there's a lot of things to mine. I want to mine. Let's do that. 
Never mind if it's rusty and if it's back. Need to clear room anyway. Okay, it's bricks. I just find some rocks. Never mind. Yeah, so let's explore the dent. Iron stuff again. Yeah, okay, I'm lucky that they are all here because I can use my Rod of Thunder. Ay, ay, ay. Um, they're not dead. Giant crab and the giant toad moderately wounded. I can whip it. Or I w no, 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 no. So he can, he can hit me in a range of two. What he did. Edge me for one. Okay, I have armor. The other one. Giant crab. Millionly. So. Oh, that's okay. I can. It's not cold resistant. Uh, yes, it is cold resistant. I have to whip it. Okay, this is. Okay, it's fleeing. Yeah, I close the door and I rest. Oof. Okay. Yeah, let's rest. Let's rest. Oh no! Animated end. Whip you? No ball. Really? No ball. Okay, close the door. Okay, there's a lot of stuff, stuff going on here. Here too, because the door just opened and it wasn't to this monster here, I think. But the door just opened like that? Just to make me afraid? <laughs> Alarm trap, so now every monster knows I'm here. There is a dead adventure, there is ice block, there was a... Oh, I can't remember if it was a fountain or a teleporter, let's look at them. I think it's a... I think it's a magic portal. All this fight. No bows and I don't want to go into darkness. So, hop hoping that it's connected. Strategy in this kind of games, but another black gloves. Yeah, that's weird. Often find. You always, it's like when you find something, I don't know, the dev told me the other wise, but when you find an item, you have much more higher chance to find the same item. I've never found this black gloves before in any game. No, I find two of those. That's really weird. Never used those at the moment. Ring of war, like that. Oh no, it's how easy. So yeah, I just have to remind myself, if I engage into a fight, I will have to aim. So this is wardrobe, which has nothing. Okay, so let's go down here. Why is there? Seven. This is a pretty good run. Never been this far. As often as I would. Uh, uh, electric eye. Range 2. Okay, this is what interests me. Throwing daggers and the uh, longbow, maybe. Let's grab the throwing daggers without waking anybody. That's good. Fire ant. Like those, and maybe the longbow. Because I only have a light bow. I could have a long bow. Yes. 
got the Z one is red red as well can I do oh but they are come on they are just fire ant I can throw snowballs at them what of Yeah, I can... No, oh, let's go... No. There is no point engaging into a... Without being sure that it will bring me victory. Ice wall again. This is an ice themed run or what? <laughs> oh no, I will find creatures like an ice wolf. So, an ice wolf. Three damage. Yeah, but I have some good arrow. I have. No, I. Okay, let's equip the, um, the Ring of War. Is okay. Ring of War. Let's equip. Oh, it up my melee. And with my um, iron melee, I can uh, use my whip already in front. Let's try slightly wounded. So let's try another whip. Oh, no. give me three? Seriously? Because I resisted before, I had 25% chance. I had zero resistance, yes, of course. I had only one chance on, far, on four. Oh, well, okay. Uh, yeah, I died. And um, I should have used my Rod of Thunder, maybe. Yeah, well, I'm not even mad. It was a good run. I had fun, and I hope you had fun watching me play too. Uh, I think you have seen right now most of the mechanics of this game. And I hope it will uh, make you want to try it to play. It's really fun as you can see and every game is really different. You have different stock and you have to adapt. So yeah, thank you for watching and uh, please feel free to comment, to give your suggestions. Please remind that English is my first language. So thank you very much and yeah, see you later. Bye bye.